welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing the Boxy Charm for November. So we have the books right here. So this month's theme is Gold Digger. It's like Gold Digger, but get it? Gold Digger, Gold Digger. <laughs> so I have my face pretty much on. I'm just missing, you know, like my eye part and lips and stuff. But the first item in the box is Ace Beauty. I don't know. There's an accent in the E. This is the Grandiose Palette. Oh, these are some pretty colors. It has four shimmer shades and four bold mattes. And this retails for $24.99, which is pretty good. You've got eight colors in total and they look pretty pigmented. And then the next item is the Luxie Luminous Eye Set. And this retails for $21. Now I'm really bad at knowing like what each brush is for. Oh, that's beautiful. They have sparkles in them. Okay, the other item is the Jaunty Blue. Jean, Jean Te Blue. We got another one of these eyeliner um, a few months back. I think it was like in the May or June. I didn't really like the eyeliner. It was really harsh. Oh my gosh, it was a big hot mess. This one has glitter in it, which is really pretty. You probably can't tell, but there's like little glitters right here. This is a glittering star eyeliner, and this one retails for five bucks. Not bad. I'm gonna do very simple, very basic, because that's me, very basic. So I'm just gonna fast forward and I'll show you guys, you know, the look along the way. my lashes off camera and I really like these lashes but we're not talking about the lashes. So the next item in the box is the Cover Effects Glitter Drop. I bought the Cover Effects Custom Enhancer Drops and I thought that's the one that we got but no this is the enhancer. I think this is kind of like a highlight and this is the glitter. But I was like crap I paid so much for this. Well I paid half because I got it like half off but still I was like mm. ooh, it looks kind of orange on the camera but it's a little like golden if that makes sense multi-dimensional glitter you could see in the bottle it has like different shades in there it's got like a mix of everything it looks very pretty this says it could be used alone under or over makeup or mixed into your foundation or moisturizer i'm gonna try and use it i never use creams or liquids over my face i don't know how so i'm a little bit nervous but i'm just gonna apply it to the areas i normally highlight because i haven't done any of that as you can see um. beautiful i don't like it for my face though it just looks like glitter i'm not sure if you could tell and i'm gonna apply it to my chest area to see the chest is gonna look very pretty wow i get red easily on my chest so ignore the red wow that's a lot of glitter that's really beautiful okay i don't feel as bad i am gonna like it for the body for the face, not so much. Those retail for $44. 
Oh my gosh. These are expensive. The good thing about them is that they last you a long time though. I mean that I used like three, how many drops was that? Like four, five, six, seven, eight drops? And I mean, that's kind of a lot. Like I think I went bananas with it. It's expensive, but it'll last you a long time. Better paying for something expensive, but you know it's gonna be good and it's gonna last you for a long time. And you're gonna like, rather than paying a little bit and it's not gonna, you know what I mean. And then the last item in the box, which I already used, is the Bodyography makeup brush cleaner and it's made from natural orange peel mm. so it easily disinfects and conditions your brushes and this one retails for $12 like it will clean it you'll see you can't see but just trust my word um you can still see like the shade inside but either even if you but even if you see it in here the shade is not going to transfer over on the skin obviously when you go wash it it's going to remove all the pigment but for a quick fix it does a pretty good job. So let's do the math quickly. Yes, it comes up to be 106.99, 107 for the full box. But remember, we only paid $21, which is amazing. The overall, oh my gosh, I love this palette. It was so easy to work with. And mind you, remember, I'm not good at blending. I'm learning, you know, so I used the top four and they were all great. The brushes were super nice. I used them all, but yes, I really like these. So beautiful so great and they're synthetic they're easy to work with they're easy to blend super soft these feel like a dream the eyeliner i really like the concept of it it kind of matches the whole theme i'm starting to kind of understand boxycharm a little bit more they all kind of make what the theme is about oh my god i can't believe it took me this long to finally like realize i mean when i initially swatched it it's very beautiful because you have the glitter on there this wasn't my favorite but I don't hate it. Not at that point yet where I could just easily get rid of things. So this one I am going to keep because it did essentially apply on my eye. It glided easy but it was just it was kind of like aggressive like rough. I don't know if it's because of the glitters. I definitely like this one better than the other one we got. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you enjoyed the video and you want to see more about me and I will see you in my next one. Bye! <laughs>